Tristan Thomas. The baseball schedule is well underway. As for the most part, we've avoided a major round of cancellations thus far. Plenty of teams in action today in Class B, including Shiloh Christian taking on Hazen. Let's go to the highlights from Dwyer Field. Top of the third, Shiloh leading 2-0. Two runners on for the Bison. And this pitch gets away from Eli Thompson behind the plate. Hazen on the board with the runner scoring from third. The Skyhawks respond in the home half of the inning. Chopper to third. Michael Foggerland takes off for home and beats the throw with a head first slide. Lead grows 3-1. to one. Later in the inning, Justin Bosch brings in another run for the ground ball to second as the Skyhawks extend their lead in the frame with a pair of runs. Skyhawks take both of today's games. Over to Jack Hoven Park in Minot, Southbury Max taking on Velva Drake Animus. It's offensive fireworks in the early innings, but the defense is starting to settle in. The Aggies strand ducks on the pond as Dalen Rullen fields the ground ball and steps on the bag. Velva starting to find its own footing on defense. Carson Larson, pair of punch outs, keeping it a one run game in the second. Aggies tie it in the third as the Royals look to reclaim the lead. A nice play. Over third with the glove by Reggie Bruner to field the grounder for the 5-3 putout. And Velva rolls on to win both games. Moving to some of the other Class B baseball games. It's Surrey hosting Bishop Ryan. The Mustangs strike first in the bottom of the first. Luke Wagner with a grounder to third. Nice hustle play to beat the throw and pick up an RBI as well. Surrey builds a three-run lead. This inning, Jet Lundin out of the jam with a punch out to retire the side. On the other side, it's Andrew Eby dealing on the bumps, striking out the side in the home half of the inning to keep the Lions scoreless in the early going. Bishop Ryan, a come from behind winner in game one, while Surrey wins big in game two. 